We're here to establish a new United States performance standard, and we call it the Lightning Lap. Now, we're here at Virginia International Raceway to establish the U.S. version of a lap of the Nürburgring. So this track here, it's a natural road course. It's four miles long, so it's a little bit shorter. But this place, let me tell you, is really challenging. It's got a lot of hills. It's got a lot of curves with hills, a lot of dips, a lot of S's, a lot of fast turns, a lot of slow turns. It's a hairy place. So basically, we're here. We took 15, 16 cars. We ran them all. And so we hope that this will supplement our usual 0 to 60, quarter mile, lateral acceleration, all the other performance stuff that we do every month. The grand circuit that we ran at VIR really had a little bit of everything. Terrific circuit. I mean, I think it's easily the best circuit in, in the States. It's the most challenging. It's got lots of high-speed corners. It had some very high-speed corners. The high-speed S's on the back were really intimidating. It seemed like the apex every turn is a crest of a hill, so just when the car is getting light and you want the most traction at the apex, you have the least because the car is kind of unweighted. And uh, in the faster cars, it was you're going through there 90, 100 miles an hour, and it just takes your breath away. It's a terrific place to work out whether a car's a good handling car, to be asked of whether a car copes well with changes of direction, elevation, whether the damping's sorted, and also whether it's got good brakes and whether it really does transition well between corners and different types of corners. And it has the combination of the fast stuff that really scares you a little bit and the, some of the uh, slower blind turns that require uh, uh, a lot more brain power than you might think. Okay, well, I hope you enjoyed our time at VR. We'll be back probably within the next year, so look for updates.